The WWE Universe with an electric feeling here tonight. We are sold out and raring to go. I am amped up, pumped up, jacked up, and ready to kick things off. What are we waiting for, fellas? Let's have some fights. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 459 pounds, Hulk. You can see exactly why the arena is full here tonight. This is a match with major stakes. He said he'll steal the show here tonight, and he looks more than ready to deliver on that promise. The leader of the Attitude Era, the Rattlesnake. The biggest anti-hero in WWE history. And his opponent from Victoria, Texas, weighing in at 252 pounds, Stone Cold Steve Austin. So many amazing moments, but... <laughs> Corey, remember when Stone Cold stunned Byron? Oh my God, yes. How could I forget? Hey, at least I got a free adult beverage out of it. I thought you didn't drink, Byron. Well, only with Stone Cold. And you can sense the anger emanating from the competitor tonight. Eyes like a blazing fire. This is a man you don't want to be in front of right now. He's a man possessed is what he is. And then whenever Austin enters an arena, he puts the WWE Universe into a mass hysteria. Austin 316 is a phenomenon, but I guarantee you Stone Cold's focus is only hell-bent on one thing. And that's stomping a mud hole and walking it dry. I guess that's two things. with a reversal. Look out! See that same time from the top. Austin just stomping away. Counter! And now there's an opening. Austin dodges that one. DDT plants that. Elbow drop. Piercing. 
Devastating kick. Absolutely brutal. Ruthless. Good night. Relentless offense from Steve Austin. Nothing can stop Stone Cold. Right on the arm. Pray, let's talk about the plan of attack when facing Stone Cold. You have to defend against an immediate onslaught. Austin likes to take the advantage early, so you have to cut him off at the pass and go right at him instead. Show Austin you're not intimidated. Sharp punch. Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. And somehow kicked out. I cannot believe the beating he's been able to endure. And it's going to take composure now. Could just need one more big move. Stone Cold too slow there. He had it scouted. Strong oh, kick. My goodness. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. What a knockout punch! Oh, man. He's getting pushed down into the defensive. They've definitely taken their lumps at this point. Their opponent is not messing around. Cobra Clutch! Got it cinched in! Fading fast. And the Russian leg sweep! And the Hulk is no match for Stone Cold Steve Austin. Y'all thought I wasn't here, huh? <laughs> I'm just watching the show. This it's, a late, it's a late show today, yeah. the biggest of his career by far. What a battle. Respect to both competitors. And this I love. This I absolutely love. Maybe you should have taken a page out of that kid's book in your career, Corey. Great sportsmanship. I would have hit him in the mouth. And again, we're fighting each other. G great, I guess.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 229 pounds, B. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. A very high-pressure situation ahead for this guy, but he is more than ready for it. Rowdy Ronda Rousey's back. And her partner from Venice Beach, California, the WWE Women's Champion, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Rousey possesses amazing striking skills and is one of the world's best submission specialists. I think there's a strong likelihood we're going to see broken limbs and faces courtesy of Ronda Rousey. And from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 210 pounds, the Anomaly. I can't watch this entrance. I heard this one backstage talking up their own work nonstop. Well, why don't they get in the ring and prove it, huh? Uh, that's what they're doing right now, Corey. Well, good. Let's see what they've got then. Here's the total package of women's wrestling. The Glamazon. And from Buffalo, New York, the Glamazon, Beth Phoenix. You know, the competition has changed so much since uh, Beth Phoenix's heyday, but this is a new chance to test the metal. No, oh, you're right, Byron, but Beth Phoenix was ready for the evolution before the evolution was ready for her. Tonight, Phoenix gets comeuppance. The youngest Hall of Fame inductee in the history of WWE. Mixed tag match underway. This is going to be fun. <laughs> Alabama slam! That was all sorts of nasty. Uh-oh. Backbreaker. Oh, my, what a splash. Getting him into the corner. Lariat. Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Rousey's got the arm. He's gonna break it. Whoa. And she's using this moment Dude. to summon all of her strength. She 
gets the tag. That means her opponent has to leave the ring, too. Kick and sent all the way to the outside. Look out! Oh, they barely came up with this. Hurricane Rana on the floor. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. Oh, colliding with a barricade. He's got the answer for that one. Foul driver on its way. Oh, oh, This is going to hurt. Dante Saito. Six. Seven. The referee counted, urging them to get in the ring. Oh, man, by the skin of his teeth. Jeez, what a way to make us sweat. Come on, count along if you want. The 10 beats of the modern. Shot after shot after shot. My goodness. Uh-oh, Wilbarrow into a bottom breaker. Now he's been put on the defensive. Measured knee drop. isn't being given any room to recuperate. Seven. He's got to wake up and get in the fight. Eight. Saw that one coming. Took advantage. Look at him totally fighting with the WWE Universe right now. He tags out, so now the women are going to go one-on-one. -on -one. the tables. Beth looking to get back in this. Beth showing it's not time to lie down. It's time to fight back. Oh, quite an effective counter. Ooh. What a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. their chance. And he's able to reverse. Oh, jaw shattering. The colossal clutch. Incredibly important moment right there, being able to get to the ropes. It can't be understated how much that could have just saved this match. She goes under the ropes and back into the ring. Oh! Superb awareness. Now she makes move kind of here. And the torch away. The torch. Perhaps thinking something else here. Not sure why, though, Michael. She seemed to have... She's looking for the win. Digging deep for a kick out. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Great counter and press 
Lots of ring IQ on display there. That's in the arm. Not done yet. Into the arm breaker. Hammer lock. Here's another quick look at some of the highlights. helping catapult her team to victory. The wrestling gods have truly blessed this union. I fully expect to see more showings like this going forward from this duo. <laughs> Feel the power! The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Parks Unknown. Weighing in at 275 pounds, the Ultimate Warrior! He's held multiple championships, has won so many main events. To be totally honest, I could sit and listen to Warrior pontificate for hours, even though I haven't understood a word he's uttered in years. It's okay, the Ultimate Warrior sounds cool saying it anyway. You just made it uncool. Congratulations. You ruined my childhood. Or we are in for a treat tonight. The cocky young cruiserweight, former ECW star who has had unmatched success in WCW. And his opponent from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 205 pounds, Eddie Guerrero. The former WCW Cruiserweight and United States Champion, a man who has held the ECW television title. And above all, Eddie Guerrero doesn't care if he's liked. He's not sure if he ever will care.
Eddie Guerrero always sporting that cocky look on his face, but to Guerrero's credit, he always backs it up inside the ring. He may be a cruiserweight, but he can take on anyone. We're underway, and the Ultimate Warrior is ready to show that he is the most powerful force in all the universe. There are many other competitors who stake that very same claim, but Warrior welcomes the challenge to prove him wrong tonight. Prepare for unbottled exuberance. Warrior in this one. And he'll be dealing with the fiery high flyer, Eddie Guerrero. This superstar has a wealth of potential if he can just remain composed and keep his emotions in check. I completely disagree, Saxton. It's Guerrero's emotions that set him apart from the pack. Eddie knows exactly how to weaponize his anger into offense. Oh. Sharp elbow. Setting him up, got the head scissors on. Devastating elbow. Warrior able to counter. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. Stomping down! Definitely not where you want to be right now. Just carried like a ragdoll here. Uh-oh. Look at this. He just tossed the leg. Ooh, that's how you dominate your opponent. Which one is the most vital in winning this match, Corey? Eddie's got a set of high-risk moves that are second to none. Once Eddie's got you down, it's just a matter of taking to the skies and ending the match for good. Lifted way high to the heavens. Eddie looking like a man possessed. Guerrero's he thinks he has it. One, two, just gets the shoulder up. He got close there. It could be do or die time. And up the turnbuckles we go. We're in the The Warrior tapped into something otherworldly to kick out just then. And now Eddie has to shake that outcome off. He has to keep his mind on his opponent. On a drop kick to the spine. And Eddie pays for leaving an opening. Oh, merciless knee to the face. Considered Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Eddie is sending to the top. From the heavens. The power, the strength, and now just pressing. That is something else. Hoping to end it here. This is it. Inhuman at this point. On the move. And it stands. Does Guerrero have anything left? He's on the road to the left. Wisely stops the count. 
And a reversal by Guerrero. Oh, Kim right with a gut. Hoisted way up high. This is gonna be bad. Driven down, powerball. Looking for the victory. No, he gets the shoulder up. I didn't think we'd see a kick out there. He's going for it all. Look at the high We know Eddie must be feeling desperate right now, unsure of how much more he needs to do. You've got to wonder how much has been taken out of these superstars thus far. And is there anything left? Pendulum backbreaker. Tick tock. Getting tossed around. And send him a bullet into the hands. That's going to hurt. He's just getting beaten at all fronts here. At this point, it might be too much for him to recover from, Cole. This is it. One, two, no, Eddie Guerrero says not yet. Incredible resiliency. These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. Here is your winner, Eddie Cole. This is the type of victory where you really have to weigh the costs against the benefits. The Ultimate Warrior was defeated tonight, but you can bet he'll be back with a vengeance. Gentlemen, Hulkamania is about to run wild. There is only one, the Immortal. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Venice Beach, California. Weighing in at 302 pounds. Who can? So between WCW and WWE, Hogan has had double-digit world title reigns. 
Not to mention he's a two-time WWE Hall of Famer and the biggest name in the business in the 80s and 90s. WWE Universe is going crazy! I don't understand why all this hot dogging and grandstanding already. The match hasn't even begun yet. Don't you know, Corey? Hogan feeds off the energy from the WWE Universe. It's gonna power him through this match. And by the way, what you gonna do when Hulkamania runs wild on you? That's pretty good, right? No, terrible. At least you and Hogan have the same hairline. <laughs> And his opponent from Japan, weighing in at 226 pounds, the Devil. We're looking at some of the most intense competitors in all of WWE, about to take part in one of the most anticipated matches ever. the most unshakable superstars on the roster. Absolutely a picture of resilience. He's been through ups and downs, but has never given up the fight. Bitter perseverance is what will make him such a threat in this matchup. And that said, how can Hogan come out here and think the training, the prayers, the vitamins, and believing in yourself is enough to get the job done? Oh, just sit back and watch, Corey. I look forward to seeing your face when the Hulkster makes a believer out of you, brother. Sent into the corner. And he finds an answer for the Hulkster. Powerless position to be in right now. Oh, man, right to the esophagus. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. That'll turn your lights out. Producing a trampling. He reverses it. Kicks to the lower back. Clutching the wrist. Just absolutely punishing their opponent here. Relentlessly.
Oh, my. Inflicting pain at will. Brutal stomp to the body. And just getting started. Look at this brutality. This is how you torture your opponent. Oh, my God. This is hard to watch. Wrists captured and cover. No, a kick out. Not time to expect victory yet. Oh, solid form. No mercy being shown to Hogan here. The Hulkster now with a daunting task ahead of him. Big reversal from the Hulkster. Ooh. Hogan won't be able to get the job done if he takes more attacks like that. Corey, if Hogan has his way, do you think this will be somewhat of a wrestling match, or can we expect a straight brawl? I think Hogan will stay within himself and use the fighting tactics of... From the top! Diving thrust kick! Coming in hot! Taking this outside. This could be good. This is an incessant attack being brought to him. He's going to have to dig out of this in a hurry. Check back right to the midsection. He's in under the ropes. Hogan with the boot. Are you watching, Corey? For Hulk. Here comes Hogan. Hogan can taste it now. Into the pit attempt. Two. Hangs on by a thread. Unreal. Unreal to kick out there. Not only unlikely, downright extraordinary. And no doubt Hogan has found a groove in this match. He can't become discouraged now. He gets out of the way. Oh, a knee smashing the face. Big kick. Oh, caught in the chin. Ooh. Hogan getting out of harm's way. Rear chin lock, and now just rapid fire punches. Where's the honor in that? And Hogan gets stonewalled. Quick exchange of counters there. Draped across the top rope. Flying four. Here he goes for the win. And he closes it out. Great officiating. As the ref noticed, he was on the ropes. From the top. Driving down the drop. Are you kidding me? He has just completely lost his wind. Holding on by a thread. Maybe even less at this point. Hogan here asserting dominance. Great power game from Hogan here tonight. He came to brawl. Now it's it. Palm strikes. Well scattered reversal there. Hogan looking to end it. He takes control. Uh-oh. Hard sidekick. Brutal stomp to the body and just getting started. Look at this brutality. This is how you torture your opponent. Oh my God, this is hard to watch. Surprise, but I am still stunned by the blood that keeps running through the Hulkster's veins. What's the tally on how many times we thought this match was coming to an end? I can't count anymore.
This has become a monumental struggle for these competitors. It is down to who still has the energy, the resolve, to put the pedal to the metal. Like he's got 11 arms and feet. Now a big swing of momentum against Hogan. Also has to find a way, find something. And he shut the door on this one. That match is worth another look. Here we go. Here is your winner, the Devil. Guys, it's rare we see such a closely contested match. No doubt about it, support for this guy grows by the second in the estimation of the WWE Universe. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from your darkest fears. Weighing in at 189 pounds, the Wick. All these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance. I can't wait to see what unfolds. Always walking around with a chip on his shoulder. He's going to use that anger against his opposition. Big Sexy is ready for a fight. Black and white, Wolfpack, NWO for life. And his opponent, representing the Outsiders, from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 328 pounds, Kevin Nash! As calculating and controversial as they come. Nash has next-level power and also next-level tricks up his sleeve. Kevin Nash quite simply knows how to win. Kevin Nash has dominated his competition for years.
Here's a man who likes to hurt people and look good doing it. An original outsider, Kevin Nash. Big sexy in the building. A revolutionary talent with major championship credentials. You're looking at one of the savviest superstars to ever navigate our business. A true trailblazer in our industry and ruthless competitor in the ring. Yeah, but he's staring at someone who's shown a lot of hustle to be in this spot. Whether he's studying tape or spending extra time at the PC, he expected this challenge and is ready for it. Didn't see that coming. Oh. Oh. What the leg? Look at this. She just tossed the leg. Elbow drop. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Yeah, Nash just let loose with that ruthless offense. And Corey, how does one match up to a superstar as powerful as Kevin Nash? Nash is a veteran of this industry, but he's had a few injuries in the past. Target his legs and his infamous quads. Take away his movement, which limits his offense, and force him to play defense. Saw that one coming. Two. Nice takedown. He's getting a huge boost right now from all those chants and cheers. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. Knee strike. Really just laying it in. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. To the sky. Oh, and he doesn't connect. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Are you kidding me? Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Oh, Nash gets cut off. What grace. Float over the DDT. Fight two. And he's able to counter. Re-enters under the ropes. Four. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. And this one might be headed ringside. The sound of this crowd is deafening, and he's asking for more. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Down for DDT. Two. Sexy. I don't think this is gonna end well. All the way up. Jack nice. That's it. Nash just oh, ended things. Two. No, my, that was close. I thought for sure this thing was wrapped up. Well, stay in your seat. Looks like we've got a ways to go yet. Though you gotta believe he'll be looking for the kill shot one more time. Float over. He's struggling a bit here. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way.
And here's another peek at some of the more memorable parts of the match. This victory is exactly the kind of statement I knew he wanted to make here. This was a message from him to the entire WWE Universe. I heard this man's been saying some bad things about you, Saxton. What? What'd you hear? The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 287 pounds, the bad guy, Razor Ramon. Talk about an iconic intercontinental champion of course he made the ladder match famous in his wars with Shawn Michaels and don't forget gentlemen few superstars have been able to recover from the razor's edge One of the most charismatic competitors in WWE history. Well, this is an extraordinary sight. Goosebump-inducing. The awe-inspiring entrance of The Undertaker. Darkness has completely engulfed this entire building. Admit it, Byron, you're scared. A little bit. We are seeing a legend in the flesh. And from Death Valley, weighing in at 299 pounds, the Undertaker! The magnificent 
opposites of the Phenom. Truly a mesmerizing scene. The legendary Phenom creates an atmosphere unlike anything you will see. Talk to anyone who's ever been in the ring opposite The Undertaker, and they will tell you nothing prepares you for this. The stoic walk of the dead man. You know, Undertaker is a time-honored warrior of the ring. No matter what you do, I'm not sure there's anything that prepares you for The Undertaker. So many superstars have stood across the ring from the dead man, paralyzed with fear. He is the first true giant in the history of the WWE, the eighth wonder of the world. That's an understatement, Saxton. Andre makes grown men look like children. And from Grenoble, France, weighing in at 520 pounds, the eighth wonder of the world, Andre! When you talk about unmatched supremacy, you are looking at one of the building blocks of WWE in Andre the Giant. Not your normal opponent, Andre the Giant. I have no idea how you would go to battle with this guy. A truly awesome figure to behold. try on his $500 shirt? Of course I can believe it, because your bank account's about 499 bucks short. He's the trailblazing, eyebrow-raising phenomenon. The great one, ready for action.
He's a two-time Hall of Famer ready to make a little noise. And from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 212 pounds, Think about what X-Pac brings to the equation. Lightning fast martial arts strikes, incredible high-flying attacks. X-Pac can do it all. The first superstar to be a member of both the NWO and D-Generation X. You are looking at a superstar who was once told he couldn't cut the mustard in WCW, but has since proven that to be terribly wrong with multiple tag title and cruiserweight title wins. It's the Nature Boy. And from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 245 pounds, the Nature Boy, Rick Flair. Corey, can you imagine hanging out with Flair? Absolutely, I've imagined it. That's probably all I'll ever get to do. A lifestyle I can only dream of. That's what it's like when you're running with the four horsemen. This man is invincible. Dragunov's a man who struggles to keep his rage in check, but when Dragunov loses it, let's be honest, it's a lot of fun to watch. And from Moscow, Russia, Weighing in at 187 pounds, Ilya Dragunov. You are looking at one of the hardest hitting competitors in NXT history. A man who's ready to unleash fury on the entire WWE roster. There is pure intensity in the eyes of Dragunov. That's beyond intensity, Saxton. Those are the eyes of a man possessed. Well, I, for one, cannot wait to see Dragunov compete here tonight. And their opponent from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 423 pounds, Thunderbolt Ross. You know, this person takes some pride in their work, but who could blame them? Few are as gifted in the ring as this performer. Wow, you are laying it on thick, Saxton. Don't worry, I'm sure they'll hear you when they watch this match 10 times before bed tonight.
A man who elevates his game every week. He is competing at his highest level yet. No pinfalls tonight, Corey. Just one superstar trying to impose their will on another, forcing them to submit. That's right, Cole. And in a submission match, you have to exploit any weakness you own match. So an ankle, break that thing. So ripped.
Rollins won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. It's a roundabout strike. Got to find a way out of the camel clutch. That'll do it. Oh, it gets put into the barricade. Back into the action. Bad predicament right here. And the official calls it clearly they cannot fight any longer. That match deserves another look. Here we go. superstar who beat the numbers game here tonight. Yeah, with an elimination match, your number can be up at any moment. But they've managed to outmaneuver all the other competitors here tonight.